Welcome back to Area DMG. I'm your host, Phil Pussy, the Mile High Mouth, and today I'm going to go ahead and answer a question that people have been asking me. Um, we get this question a couple times every couple months, and I realize that there's not a video that shows this off. But people were wondering, will a 3DS game work in a DSi or DS Lite system? I've got DS Lite over here and a DSi XL. And, um, you see, people were wondering if anybody's sawn off the little nub or cut off the little nub and checked to see if one of these worked. So I bought this copy of Steel Diver over at GameStop for a dollar and something after tax. And, um, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to clip off that little thing there to find out. We're going to find out. Okay, actually, let me, yeah, actually, I don't have to... If I'm going to put that in, I have to make sure that this is off before I turn it on, and this one doesn't have to be off. But yeah, let's go ahead and uh, turn these on, because like when I put that in there, it'll definitely show that there's, you know, it'll show, if, it's, if it detects it, it'll show it in the game slot. But yeah, <sighs> don't try this at home, kitties, because trust me, um, the results are going to be disappointing. Eek. Well, I'm trying to figure out the best way to to clip this poor thing. Okay. Ay ay ay. Okay, that's that's kind of gross. Ouch. Poor thing. Ugh, this this gives me no no sense of joy. Cuz I actually like I actually like Steel Diver. It's a good game. Mm. Poor thing. Well, let's cut this a little bit more with this. Put these little plastic pieces out there. You see, it's just that that's empty. That little thing there is empty, so I'm not going to hurt the board or anything. But let's go ahead and uh, let's try putting it into this DS light. See, it will fit in there if you chop that up. Now let's go ahead and turn that on there and see what it does. Hit that, that power button up. And it does not detect it. Not at all. It does not see the game. Okay, let's turn that off. Now let's pop it into this real quick. Because like the way this is designed, you just put that in there and it should and it's not detecting it okay let's turn this off and we'll turn it back on again and see if it'll detect it nothing the Nintendo DS the DSi will not even detect a 3DS game of course let's make sure this 3DS game works so let's go ahead and put it into a normal 3DS. Okay, nothing is there. There we go, Steel Diver. So pretty much if you put in a 3DS game into a Nintendo DS or a DS Lite, even if you chop off that little thing which is supposed to prevent you from physically putting it into the system, it still will not work because it doesn't detect it as anything. It doesn't detect it as anything. But it'll still work in a, a 3DS or a 2DS or a new 3DS or a new 3DS XL or a 3DS XL. But yeah, that's what happens when you uh, very brutally massacre a poor game card, poor thing, and uh, put it into a Nintendo DS or DS Lite does not detect it. I feel sorry for this because Steel Diver is actually a pretty underrated game. But yeah, I'm your host, Will Bussy, the Mile High Mouth. Um, now you know what happens if you do that. Um, let me know in the comments below what you thought and uh, hit that share button if anybody asks you this question and uh, let them know. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and until the next video comes out, you are now caught up.